All right, guys, today I'm going to talk to you about this uh, little application called Extended Navbar. And this is an exposed module. Um, and it does a, kind of a really cool thing. So I've already downloaded it. You can get it at the Google Play Store. Um, no big deal. Download it. You probably could download it from Exposed Framework Installer. I'm sure you could probably get it from there too. And I'm going to go ahead and show you how this functions. So it is pretty cool. Basically, we're just going to go back uh, to my home page. And here is the application. Um, I will go into the settings of it. There isn't really much to it. But like I said, you do have to have exposed. So to have exposed, you have to have right here the exposed installer. And you have to have super sue root permission. So here's your exposed installer. Once it's downloaded, you just need to go into modules. Check the little box there and the little blue check mark for extended nav bar. And go ahead and do a reboot to make sure everything is enabled. All right. So once you have everything enabled and you're good to go, you have your application. This is what extended navbar does, and I really like it. I think it's pretty cool. I'll show you. So if you swipe your navigation keys down here to the side, now you have all of your quick toggles right here. Um, you can turn on your Bluetooth, um, turn that stuff on and off, Wi-Fi, network, GPS. Here, I'll turn off GPS. See, it shows you a little notification up there about it. Turn it back on. Airplane mode and all that kind of good stuff right there. All can be done here from the nav bar. So if you swipe it back the other way, you have your standard navigation keys. And if you swipe it the other way, you have your play um, and your skip and back uh, for your audio. So I'll actually show you one of those. It's kind of cool. You just hit it. And you should be able to pick that up. Music. Very, very neat. Very, very neat. Pause. And obviously you can you know, go to the next song and so on. So that's basically what this does. Let me just get rid of that. And uh, I'll show you basically the settings on it. So um, left page is music player, right page is quick settings. And you can adjust these, but the only other option you really have to do is you can see here you can do music, quick settings. Favorite apps is if you donate to the application, I think it's like a dollar ninety nine, then you can put favorite apps on one side or nothing if you don't want to be able to scroll that direction. Um, that's basically how you set it. And then obviously once you pick out whatever, however you want it done, however you want to set it up, just do your reboot device right there and you are good to go. So that's basically what this does. It is a very simple application. Um, basically just adds these cool little buttons down here to your navigation keys. Hope you guys like this quick little video here on extended navigation bar. And a very cool app. Check it out for yourself. I'll give you guys all the links you need in the video description down below. And we'll catch you guys in another Exposed Frameworks video. Talk to you later. Root Junkie, out.